Hola a todos, ¿cómo están? En la clase de hoy tenemos preparado para ti algo muy especial. Podrás medir cuánto vas progresando. Primero, busca una hoja de papel o algo. Ve, voy a esperarte unos segundos. Bien, ¿ya la tienes? Ahora voy a explicarte qué vamos a hacer. Este torneo estará dividido en dos rondas. Cada una de las rondas cuenta con tres tipos de exámenes. Y solo sacando las mejores calificaciones podrás pasar a la segunda ronda del torneo. Esto es un torneo. Si aceptas entrar en el torneo, escribe en comentarios, estoy en el torneo. Empecemos. Primera ronda del torneo, semifinal de comprensión auditiva. Josh, I'm really hungry. Do you know of a good restaurant we could go to? Yeah, there's a pretty good chicken restaurant near my house. Josh, I'm really hungry. Do you know of a good restaurant we could go to? Yeah, there's a pretty good chicken restaurant near my house. Josh, I'm really hungry. Do you know of a good restaurant we could go to? Yeah, there's a pretty good chicken restaurant near my house. Chicken. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's got all kinds of chicken. It's got fried chicken, baked chicken, broiled chicken, so on. Hmm. Chicken. You know, I don't really like chicken that much. Chicken. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's got all kinds of chicken. It's got fried chicken, baked chicken, broiled chicken, so on. Hmm. Chicken. You know, I don't really like chicken that much. Chicken. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's got all kinds of chicken. It's got fried chicken, baked chicken, broiled chicken, so on. Hmm. Chicken. You know, I don't really like chicken that much. Do you know somewhere else? Somewhere that doesn't have chicken or beef. Do you know somewhere else? Somewhere that doesn't have chicken or beef. Do you know somewhere else? Somewhere that doesn't have chicken or beef. Uh, there's a vegetarian restaurant in my house, but it's down the opposite direction. Uh, there's a vegetarian restaurant in my house, but it's down the opposite direction. Uh, there's a vegetarian restaurant in my house, but it's down the opposite direction. Hmm. Okay, what, what kind of food do they have? Uh, they've got salads, fresh salads. They even have stir fry. Okay, what, what kind of food do they have? Uh, they've got salads, fresh salads. They even have stir fry. Hmm. Okay, what, what kind of food do they have? Uh, they've got salads, fresh salads. They even have stir fry. Hmm, okay. Yeah. What's the restaurant like? Uh, it's nice. It's pretty small. Hmm, okay. Yeah. What's the restaurant like? Uh, it's nice. It's pretty small. Hmm, okay. Yeah. What's the restaurant like? Uh, it's nice. It's pretty small. Um... But there's not a lot of people usually. Okay. Is it light or dark inside the restaurant? Um, but there's not a lot of people usually. Okay. Is it light or dark inside the restaurant? Um, but there's not a lot of people usually. Okay. Is it light or dark inside the restaurant? Um, it's a little dark inside, the restaurant. Mm, okay. But the food's really good. 
Um, it's a little dark inside, the restroom. Mm, okay. But the food's really good. Um, it's a little dark inside, the restroom. Mm, okay. But the food's really good. What about the tables? Do they have tablecloths or do they not have tablecloths? Uh, there's no tablecloths and the tables are a little bit low. What about the tables? Do they have tablecloths or do they not have tablecloths? Uh, there's no tablecloths and the tables are a little bit low. What about the tables? Do they have tablecloths or do they not have tablecloths? Uh, there's no tablecloths and the tables are a little bit low. Do they What about the price of the food? Is it expensive or is it cheap? Uh, it's, it's very cheap. Mm, that's good. What about the price of the food? Is it expensive or is it cheap? Uh, it's, it's very cheap. Mm, that's good. What about the price of the food? Is it expensive or is it cheap? Uh, it's, it's very cheap. Mm, that's good. For example, you could probably buy a salad for five bucks. Wow, that is cheap. Yeah. Mm. yeah. For example, you could probably buy a salad for five bucks. Wow, that is cheap. Yeah. Mm. yeah. For example, you could probably buy a salad for five bucks. Wow, that is cheap. Yeah. Mm. Okay, what about a soup? Uh, a soup is usually six dollars, but it's really good. Okay, what about a soup? Uh, a soup is usually six dollars, but it's really good. Okay, what about a soup? Uh, a soup is usually six dollars, but it's really good. Okay. Yeah. Well, I have my car today, so is there parking at the restaurant? Okay. Yeah. Well, I have my car today, so is there parking at the restaurant? Okay. Yeah. Well, I have my car today, so is there parking at the restaurant? Uh, there's some parking, but there's also a lot nearby. Okay, so no problem to park my car. No problem. Uh, there's some parking, but there's also a lot nearby. Okay, so no problem to park my car. No problem. Uh, there's some parking, but there's also a lot nearby. Okay, so no problem to park my car. No problem. Great. Okay, well, let's go for vegetarian. Great. Okay, well, let's go for vegetarian. Great. Okay, well, let's go for vegetarian. Okay, sounds great. <laughs> Primera ronda del torneo, semifinal de comprensión interpretativa. Hey Meg, we are talking about traveling and visiting other countries. What countries have you traveled to? Hey Meg, we are talking about traveling and visiting other countries. What countries have you traveled to? I've been to quite a few countries. For example, Spain, Belize, and Indonesia. Wow, 
three different continents? Yeah, pretty far apart. I've been to quite a few countries. For example, Spain, Belize, and Indonesia. Wow, three different continents? Yeah, pretty far apart. Wow, that's cool. So, Spain, that must be a really nice country. What did you think of Spain? Wow, that's cool. So, Spain, that must be a really nice country. What did you think of Spain? Spain is really beautiful. There's a lot of beautiful nature and also some nice cities. While I was there, I lived in a small city called Caceres. While I was there, I lived in a small city called Caceres. Oh, nice. Are the people really friendly in Spain? Oh, nice. Are the people really friendly in Spain? Yes, actually. The people are very friendly and very helpful. Yes, actually. The people are very friendly and very helpful. Especially if you're lost. Especially if you're lost. Oh, that's great. I hear Spanish food is really, really good. Oh, that's great. I hear Spanish food is really, really good. Spanish food is delicious. I lived with a Spanish family, and my Spanish mom cooked delicious meals every day for lunch. Spanish food is delicious. I lived with a Spanish family, and my Spanish mom cooked delicious meals every day for lunch. In Spain, seafood is really popular, so I ate a lot of fish and shrimp. In Spain, seafood is really popular, so I ate a lot of fish and shrimp. Oh, I love fish and shrimp. Me too. Now, Spain is really warm, right? Yes. Spain was very hot while I was there during the summer. Oh, I love fish and shrimp. Me too. Now, Spain is really warm, right? Yes. Spain was very hot while I was there during the summer. Oh, yeah? How hot? How hot does it get? It got up past 40 degrees Celsius during the summer. Wow. Yeah, it was pretty hot. Oh, yeah? How hot? How hot does it get? It got up past 40 degrees Celsius during the summer. Wow. Yeah, it was pretty hot. Does it rain? Oh, it does rain. But when I was there in the summer, it didn't rain very often. So what about Belize? Belize is a really small country. 
Belize is very small, but it's also hot, similar to Spain in the summer. Why did you go to Belize? Does it rain? Oh, it does rain. But when I was there in the summer, it didn't rain very often. So what about Belize? Belize is a really small country. Belize is very small, but it's also hot, similar to Spain in the summer. Why did you go to Belize? I went to Belize on a study trip for school, and I stayed there for about two weeks. I went to Belize on a study trip for school, and I stayed there for about two weeks. Primera ronda del torneo, semifinal de fluidez al hablar. Let's talk about times. Like when we do things. First, when do you get up? Yeah, I get up early too. I don't get up at 7.30, but I get up at 8 o'clock. Yeah, actually, I always wake up at 6 o'clock. I wake up very early, but I don't get out of bed. I wake up, I have some water, and then I sleep some more. I sleep two more hours. Yeah, it's a bad habit. Oh, that's so bad. I read that it's not good to check your phone in bed. I never check my phone in bed. What about breakfast? When do you eat breakfast? Oh, no time? I usually have breakfast right away. I wake up at 8 o'clock or I get out of bed at 8 o'clock and then I eat something at 8.15. I eat something as soon as I get up. Well, I always eat and I always have coffee very early. Every day, I have three cups of coffee. I have one cup of coffee around eight o'clock, I have another cup of coffee around 10 o'clock, and then I have my last cup of coffee around two o'clock or three o'clock. Yeah, my office is by a cafe and the cafe has really good coffee. I love their cafe mochas. Oh, I hear you. When do you start your day at work or school? Oh, that's fairly early. Well, I have two jobs. 
Now I make websites and I work at an office. I start at 12 o'clock, so noon. I start my day late. I finish working at 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock at night. Oh, it's great. I love it because there's no traffic at noon when I go to work and there's less traffic at night when I come home. I finish at nine o'clock and the train is not crowded and it's really nice. It takes 15 minutes by train. If the weather is nice on nice sunny days, I walk to work. It takes one hour and I walk home. It takes another hour. It is nice. I like to walk to work and I like to walk home. I work at night so I eat dinner really late. I eat dinner at 10 o'clock and that's very late and a little unhealthy. When do you eat dinner? Wow, you have dinner before I finish work. You go to bed around 10 o'clock? Wow, that's interesting because on work days, Monday to Friday, I go to bed late, but on the weekend, my days off, I go to bed early. Yeah, on Saturday night and Sunday night, I go to bed at 10 o'clock. But Monday to Friday, I work, I go to bed at 12 o'clock or 1 o'clock. I don't know. I actually don't like staying up late, but I do it for my job. It's strange, I guess. On the weekends, some people like to sleep in. On the weekends, I like to go to bed early. Segunda ronda y última del torneo. Final de comprensión auditiva, parte A. She is Maria. And they are her supposed friends. She is 20. She came from a poor family. She is Maria, and they are her supposed friends. She is 20. She came from a poor family. Maria hasn't started college because she had to get a job to pay for it, but now she doesn't have enough time to study. Maria hasn't started college because she had to get a job to pay for it, but now she doesn't have enough time to study. Maria had a dream. She wants to become a famous singer, and she wants to sing on the biggest stage in the world. Maria had a dream. She wants to become a famous singer, and she wants to sing on the biggest stage in the world. Maria had a dream. She wants to become a famous singer, and she wants to sing on the biggest stage in the world.
at Madison Square Garden. She sings really well, but she had a little problem. Study music was very expensive for her. At Madison Square Garden. She sings really well, but she had a little problem. Study music was very expensive for her. One day, Maria had a great idea. She would start to record herself singing with her phone, and she would share it to her friends. One day, Maria had a great idea. She would start to record herself singing with her phone, and she would share it to her friends. And they would share it with theirs. And then, the whole world would hear her music. The songs will become a success. and they would share it with theirs. And then, the whole world would hear her music. The songs will become a success. And a big company's music will hear it. That was a really great plan. But something went wrong. Do you know what it was? Her friends. And a big company's music will hear it. That was a really great plan. But something went wrong. Do you know what it was? Her friends. Segunda ronda y última del torneo. Final de comprensión auditiva, parte B. Maria, we're sorry. We can't share your songs. Why not? What happened? Maria, we're sorry. We can't share your songs. Why not? What happened? Uh, we don't want to hurt you, but you need to know this. Uh, we don't want to hurt you, but you need to know this. You'll never be a pop star. You're poor. You don't have money. You'll never be a pop star. You're poor. You don't have money.
The music industry is very expensive. You can't continue doing this to yourself. The music industry is very expensive. You can't continue doing this to yourself. It is degrading. You know what? My mother lost her job, and my father left us a long time ago. But I'm here, and I'll never give up on my dreams. And I'm not going to worry. Everything is fine, because now I know who my friends really are. Please, Maria, forget the music and start the college. Help your mother with the rent. Forget that dumb dream and live your reality. <laughs> Segunda ronda y última del torneo. Final de comprensión interpretativa. So, Steve, I see you have beautiful pictures of your child up here. I didn't know you had a baby. Yeah, baby Roy is about one year and four months old now. Oh, wow. That's exciting. Yeah, I mean... Everyone said there would be a lot of changes in your life, but it's probably changed my wife's life more than mine. But I still enjoy giving him his bath and helping put him to bed and playing with him in the mornings and on the weekend. Oh, that's great. So, what is it like being a father? A lot of fun. As I said, I think my wife's had a harder time looking after him during the day. The father can have the good jobs in the evening and the early mornings and on the weekends. So is your child speaking yet? Not quite, but he understands English and Japanese. So if we tell him off in either language, he runs away and starts crying. He's just started walking. Okay. Oh, that's got to be tough. It's getting tougher. We just have to childproof the house more. So how do you childproof the house? Make sure that all breakables are above the level where he can reach. That's the most important thing. Now, when you have a child, like, first of all, how much does the baby sleep? Well, he's a good sleeper. He's basically always slept from about 9 in the morning, 9 in the evening, until 6.30 or 7 in the morning. He's waking up a little bit earlier now because it's lighter earlier. Oh, wow. So what does your child like to do? Do you play special games with your... with Roy? He's into dancing at the moment. He really likes the beat of the BBC World Music, so he looks forward to the BBC News at the hour. He likes going to the sand pit and playing with the other children from the neighborhood. Well, you have a lovely child. Thank you. Segunda ronda y última del torneo. Final de fluidez al hablar. Y hoy, de nuevo, vamos a tener otra conversación entre tú y yo. Tomarás tu rol y después el mío.
Sure. My favorite color is purple. Oh, really? Oh, well, everything I wear is purple. <laughs> yeah, really. Good question. My favorite food is pizza. I love pizza, but I don't really like big pizzas. I really like spicy toppings, so salami or pepperoni, chilies, and sometimes bell peppers too. No, I don't like thick pizza because I can't eat too much. The thin pizzas, I get lots of toppings and I don't feel so full. My favorite season is winter. Yeah, I love winter, don't you? I love the snow. Yeah, I guess the cold is kind of annoying but the snow is so much fun. I go skiing and I play snowball fights and I build snowmen. I'd say my favorite sport is tennis. Yeah, but I'm not very good. At the moment, I'm having singles lessons. They're really fun. Yes, about twice a week. Yes, I watch it all the time. I really like Roger Federer. I don't have a favorite movie, but I really like comedies. My favorite comedy is Ace Ventura. It is, but it's a classic. I know. I've seen it a hundred times. Let's talk about our favorite things. First, what is your favorite color? Really? My favorite color is purple too. Yeah, but I don't have purple clothing. I love the color purple, but I don't have purple clothes. No kidding? That's so cool. What about food? What's your favorite food?
I love pizza too. What is your favorite topping on pizza? Do you like thick pizza or thin pizza? Yeah, I agree. What about seasons? What is your favorite season? Winter? No, I hate winter. Why do you like winter? Oh, I hate the snow. Well... I like the snow a little bit, but I hate cold weather. Yeah, that sounds fun. What about sports? What's your favorite sport? That's interesting. Do you play tennis? Do you like singles or doubles? Oh, now you're taking tennis lessons? Do you watch tennis on TV? Who is your favorite tennis player? Yeah, he's really good. Okay, last question. What is your favorite movie? So what is your favorite comedy? Ace Ventura is very funny, but that movie is really old. It's like 20 years old, I think. Maybe more. Yeah, I like it a lot, too. Hit it! That's what I'm talking about! Wait! Okay, now. From the beginning. Hit it, boys.